excited in the starting stalls but they're off and they're racing and a little bit sluggish by the favourite New Dimension who gave them three or four length start. Let's see if the others can make uh, can make use of that. Let's see what happens as they go towards the end of the first furlong and the Queen's Platinum Jubilee Handicap. The grey horse in the middle and the black and white Franchese on the inside in the purple and white blue Seattle King and in the blue and yellow here comes Spin Around. Running fourth is G1 to the back mark of the slow starting favourite New Dimension. Into the back straight, six furlongs left to run in the 740 here at Chelmsford City and up front Seattle King Hector Crouch taking them along to good clip on the outside spin around and Frankie Editori on the inside Francesi and Tom Marquand on the outside the horse with the red nose band just uh, taking quite a hold is G. Want and Jamie Spencer on the back marker is New Dimension and Richard Kingscote going towards the bend at the far end of the track in the Queen's Platinum Jubilee Handicap three and a half furlongs to run Seattle King and the colours of Jeff Smith leads so it's a Hales horse spin around up on the outside with Frankie in in third place, Francesi. And uh, behind their time at the back is G. Want and New Dimension. Here they come back towards us. Two and a half left to run. And up front, it's Seattle King who hasn't seen another horse in the race. Frankie Dottori moving well on spin around. Under pressure in third is Francesi. Making ground in fourth is G. Want. And now New Dimension is asked to improve. Here they come down the home straight. Coming towards the final furlong. Spin around. Now comes through to take it up. In second place is Francesi. Staying on the inside, but a long way back is New Dimension. At the last half furlong, Frankie Dottori on spin around. Francesi Tom Marquand. Frankie Dottori spin around. going to win it. Frankie! wins it in second place that was Francesi, that was a one two been around has done it under uh, Frankie de Torre and has beaten Francesi into second place, has run really well under Tom Ockhand in first time cheek pieces and uh, it's an interesting race to review which we will do with, with George now a new dimension uh, who was favourite he's just completely blown it at the start again yeah he wasn't stood square in the gates you could see him, he's messing around a little bit 